How's it going everybody? My name is Fred DeSex and welcome back to another video of mine. Today I've, I've come up with the most randomest stuff ever. What we're gonna do today, we're gonna review, well, I don't know, like I'm English, like I'm British, this sort of stuff don't come around easy. What does, I've seen it for a long time in Tesco's, which is a supermarket in Breton. Uh, yeah, so it's, it's like they have a special like, American aisle. It's pretty nice. Uh, there's some stuff I actually actually one second i actually bought this which is the lil yatti's reese's puffs baby i don't know okay i just it was like five pound or something expensive like that like that is expensive for a cereal box anyway besides the point what we're, we're going to review this the american all american snack it, it's in the american now much like that little yatti what it is is called snyder's of Hanover. Don't know where Hanover is. I'll put some stuff on the screen now to like, you know, give you some backstory or whatever. I don't know. Just join me for this ride. Hopefully one of the cameras don't break again because that's what happened in my last review. Let's just get straight into this. This is a bust with flavor. Honey. Oh, this is a honey, mustard and onion. If you have tried this before and you want to tell me about your experience with it or if you have any suggestions on what I should try next, leave it down below. Engagement. That's what we're here for. Alright, this is the other side. Stuff is falling off it. It's, you can't get more basic than the back of a packaging. It reminds me of a, of a KP Nuts bag. It's what it reminds me of the most. So let's just rip on into it. This is America's Pretzel ba ba Bakery since 1909. That's older than me. Ah! Ah! Nice. I haven't smelled it yet. Let's smell it. Oh, oh, that is divine. Oh, that is, oh, very sweet. I like that. Honey mustard. I don't like mustard personally. I like the Nando's spicy, mild, whatever the frick. I don't know. If I can find it, I'll put it on the screen now. It's basically just, I keep saying basic. I, I'm so sorry. Like my most viewed video, it's the most embarrassing thing ever. I just said basically every two sentences. Apologies. What this is, it is broken down pretzel being that it says pretzel pieces i'm sorry I, I i'm a bit stupid sometimes so let's try this wait that's what that's what it looks like um i don't know which camera is better at this point oh let's try it. i'm not a pretzel guy i really i'm not 100 percent pretzel guy if i see it between a red velvet cake and a pretzel you better know i'm going straight for that red velvet and I think you can agree. Anyway, show up, Fred. Let's just try this. Hmm. Hmm. Yes. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. If I was downing a Bex or a Heineken or a Moretti or a Foster's, basically every lager, I'd love it. It's nice as hell. After this video, I might grab myself. Oh. I want to show you something. Look what I got. I got a Stein. Something Stein. I've I've cleaned it. It's probably... I, I bought it at... I think... It, yeah, it was Morrison's. It came with... Let me just go get it. I bought it with this. And it was a grand total price of... Guess how much? I'll give you a second. Six pounds. If you guess right, then uh, make sure you smash that like button. And uh, congrats, because actually that's quite impressive to get six pounds for both of these. It's a big old hefty glass, I will say. Like, yeah, I, I don't know what I'm trying to say. But this is nice and cold now, so I'm going to open this up later. No, I won't. I want to open it up now. And I want to see if I can still do this, because I did this in my most recent video. If you haven't gone and seen it, or just see I don't know I can't make words sentences I opened the bottle with my mouth my teeth I want to see if I can do it again just so I can say it like I can open bottles with my teeth like pfft. it's always that one guy isn't it fuck it I'll be that guy oh this, this one's a bit oh my god I didn't chip my tooth I didn't I've never been more proud of myself I seriously haven't oh do you know what these are absolutely divine, these are. Mmm. Good on you, America. Where where does Bex come from? German. It's German. Should we pour it? Let's bloody pour it, lads. We get on it. Right, here we go. Here's my German Stein, Stein, or whatever. And I'm gonna have my honey mustard and onion. Here we go. Hallelujah. 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 
Oh my god, did you ever look at this? Oh god, oh god. Way too much head right there, Fred. You can't even see this on the screen. Grab it, German. <laughs> That's not, that doesn't sound German, does it? Ah. Oh. Beautiful. Mm-mm. Very nice. Do you want to see the contents? I'm sorry, I'm speaking with my mouth open, my bad. So, the fat per 100 grams, and this is a... 125 grams you get 400 grams so 500 calories uh, oh no no it says it says per pack all right my bad it says for a pack is 615 calories not that bad not that bad could be worse for an american snack 29.1 grams of saturated fats i mean that's quite high and sugars uh nine grams but guess how much carbohydrates it is it's 60.6 but that's obvious because it's pretzels and pretzels aren't healthy no matter what you have them with i made that mistake of saying it with corbin he said pretzels are healthy they're not they're just not like don't matter how you say it. oh they're gluten free oh they're sugar free piss off fuck off like they're just not uh, i've got to keep this on screen hey there we go hey that doesn't look bad does it that generally doesn't look bad oh there's a bloody hair oh you can blame my dog for that that is gross most people wouldn't have their beer now. Here we go. Down the hatch. Or well, if I can reach past the froth. <laughs> I can't get past the froth. This has gone to absolute shambles. Like, by clicking on the video, you probably had no idea I was going to do this. Uh, this is my first time having Bex, by the way. So this is a, an American pretzel pieces review slash Bex review. Two in one, baby. Two in one. <laughs> Just tastes like lager. No, it tastes like beer, sorry. More bitter than I would like. Like, for example, Moretti is a bit smoother, as well as Foster's. This is definitely on the more bitter side to me. You'd have to you'd have to have a strong tongue. Uh, uh. I don't know what that means either. I say a lot of things random. I'm gonna get so bloated. Fucking I was meant to be a young fit boy, but the age I'm going, the the rate I'm going, by the time I'm 25, I'm gonna have heart disease or some Shit thing like that. Oh my god, that's the most bitter beer I've ever had. Your sons are bitches in Germany. I buy your condiments and I buy your beer. Trying to kill me. God, it's not as if I'm doing it out of free will or anything. Anyone? Alright. It's not even that much left. <laughs> Ugh, fuck me. It's literally 20 past 3 at night and your boy's just downing a beer and some pretzels. Are you enjoying the video? Make sure you, if you are enjoying the video, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe. Helps me out. Uh, Godspeed, everyone. Can we take a second to appreciate those people that can down drinks in a second? Everyone just get on your knees or sit down or just, just take a chillax moment and just realize how godlike they are. Okay, now we're done with the prayer. Let's just <laughs> pretend I didn't nearly just die from downing it. I probably have ruined the flavor of this beautiful back pack of pretzels via this bex so bex if you're listening no don't do anything don't do anything stick to what you're doing don't don't listen to me this is probably the first and last time i'm, I'm gonna drink from this glass i'm gonna have some poor memories little yatties over there taunting me i'm not pissed i've got that much left i have the last time i bought beer was that uh blue ribbon perhaps and they even liked my tweet when I tweet when I shouted out the video. Uh, my tweet will be down below actually. I'm gonna start including it because I haven't been including it in my descriptions. <laughs> so if you wanna go follow me, then thank you. But yeah, the last time I bought Paps Blue Ribbon, it was out of date. And it wasn't until I did my second video, including blue, I don't know how to word this, but I did a podcast and my mates wanted to also try the Blue Ribbon, uh, which was already, I'd already uploaded the video of me reviewing it. So they saw it and they, and they came around and did a podcast with me and they, they wanted to try it for themselves. It wasn't until George realized that he told me that on the bottom there's the date and it was like two years out of date, two damn years. That's two times 365. No idea what that is. Yeah, is, I just drank out of date beer. That was nice. Also, I want to say this is two pints. If you're from the UK, you obviously know what a pint is. Not sure about Americans if they drink anything else other than a pint. Because you know how it is. It's like, you drink pints? You fucking weakling. I was a bit Russian, but... <laughs> 
You drink pints, I drink that in one hour. Shut up, Fred. All right, just shit it, just shit it. Oh, and if you're looking at my beautiful locks, I will be getting a haircut soon. And if you guess right what hairstyle I'm gonna go for, then you're gonna become a millionaire in the next two decades. Yeah, so if you can, could comment that down below. Let's see if you get it right. <laughs> oh, and if you do, I'll like your, I'll love your comment. I'll like click the, the love thing. I may even pin it. If you want me to pin it, then get it right. Yeah, boy. I just, I still want to appreciate you guys for watching and also the people who can drink this much. <laughs> They're fucking insane, I'm telling you. I know the size on American pretzels because I've been to Disneyland, Orlando. Oh my god, the pretzels were like twice the size of my head. Like, Come on, Germany, what are you playing at? We're freaking nearly there. Oh, and I can't believe I ever mentioned this. We're in a completely new setup now. Have you noticed? We've got coats behind us. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. Oh, and here's a little secret. If you subscribe today, you'll be finding out how I make a desk suit. This desk is gonna go away. Like, you know, this desk you see right here. Uh, where have I, uh, pardon me. Where have I put this desk? It's gonna get in the, in the skip, and I'm gonna go get a new, one because i'm gonna make it i'm gonna make a whole video of it and it's gonna be sick so subscribe today put that post notification bells on now <laughs> this is what vex does to your people turns you into an ape godzilla no king kong <laughs> without editing this this video has been 19 minutes so far fuck's sake it nearly came up <laughs> fuck's sake <laughs> I'm probably so shit faced now. I just had two pints. <laughs> my liver, my kidneys, everything that's to do with. Ah, oh. I'm gonna end this video, uh, people. I'm bad at fucking. <coughs> Fuck, what is wrong with me? I just downed a whole bottle of beer. Two pints worth, 660 milliliters. Don't do this at home, anyone, even if you're underage. Fuck it, you're probably drinking anyway, because you're watching my channel. We're all badasses here for some reason. I mean, just are. I was just fucking cool as fuck. Thank you. Anyway, so yes, if I had to rate these out of every crisp or chips, as Americans say, I'd rate these that I've tried a lot of crisps, all right? Chips in my lifetime, because I live in the UK, Britain, apparently. I'd rate this good. Four out of 10, honestly. It's the first number that came into my head. And it's probably the most rawest answer you're going to get from me. Would I try, would I buy these again? No because they're not like the nicest things in the world but will i finish off the packet yes sir yes i will <coughs> and also if you like bitter beers then go for bex if you don't and don't be like me don't get it all right yeah so i can't thank you guys enough for watching if you have enjoyed this video make sure you smash that like button and also subscribe it's that red button down below just to let you know and I gotta remind you for some reason because that's how the human brain works. Thank you very much for watching. If you have enjoyed the video, make sure you smash that like button. If you are new around here, make sure to subscribe. And I shall see you in the next video I do. Make everything. Peace out, everyone. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah. 4 out of 10. These bitches suck.